I stopped to get gas at the gas station. I was feeling a little hungry. I hadn't eaten all day. I was coming from a whole day of fun here on the weekend. And I was a little hungry. I thought, let me get a little bit of junk because sometimes on the weekends I go a little crazy and I don't eat my total healthy fitnessy diet. Um, so it was the perfect time to try something new. And I decided to try for real, for real, for real. I'm not sure how I should say that, but it is a milkshake. Mm -hmm. I was gonna get like a chocolate milk or like a coffee or a slushy, but then I thought, no, look at this. I've never seen this before. It's this machine in the gas station. It's cool. So there's a freezer and they have all these flavors. There's, I got the Reese peanut butter cups or Reese. I think in the States you guys say Reese, right? Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments below, but uh, Reese or we say Reese in Canada, Reese peanut butter cup. So it's peanut butter cups, milkshake it's called. And so you put, you get this thing from the freezer, then you put it in this machine and there's this whole computer screen. Um, and you choose if you want it the thickest, medium, or regular thickness, I think. And I picked, of course, I picked the thickest it could possibly be. <laughs> Thinking, yeah, I want a real thick, creamy um, milkshake. But I think that might have been a mistake, especially since I had to drive with it now. Because I can't, mm, like I can't, I can't suck it out of the straw. Like it's too... Okay, so it's melting a bit now. At the start, I couldn't even get it up the straw. Like they should really offer you spoons if it's gonna be like that, right? I mean, there should be spoons involved, I think. And I looked around, there were no spoons because I saw how thick it was. I was like, oh, I think I made a mistake. It was kind of like a blizzard consistency or a McFlurry from McDonald's. You know, like it's like ice cream. It's like mixed ice cream kind of. The taste is okay. I'm really hungry right now, so it tastes really good, but it has this kind of like, I don't know, like Play-Doh taste to it in it. Like it's nice flavor, but then there's also a bit of Play-Doh in there. <laughs> I don't know if you know what I mean, but like some sort of like weird plasticky Play-Doh. I think it's the yogurt taste maybe, but not all yogurts have that because I do love frozen yogurt. But it's a fun experience like making it in the gas station. Like it blends it, the computer screen tells you what's happening. And I don't know, it seemed cool. So for real? For real, I guess you're supposed to say. I don't know what that means. It's for real. Like, is it not real ice cream? I'm gonna look that up and I'll, I'll let you know on this video. Mm -hmm. See, I can get it out of the straw now a bit better because before it was so thick. It was like, I mean, I like a thick milkshake, but if it's a milkshake, it's really gotta come out of the straw at some point, right? Okay, so I checked the internet and it turns out it is not frozen yogurt, although it tastes kind of like frozen yogurt, but it's made with real, and I see it says it right here. It says it is made with 100% Canadian milk. So I guess it's a Canadian product. I need to read up more. There's a whole story on their on their site and everything about what they're doing. It says it's all natural or something, and I, I'm not sure. Uh, anyways, I saw some other cool um, flavors they have. They have cotton candy. They have cheesecake. They have mint chip. I was gonna get the mint chip. That looked pretty appealing. Um, but I went with the peanut butter cups, and the cost I think was about. I'm not sure, three something for this, and it's pretty big, pretty big. Um, and it said two, two for six, I think. So it's like a big tub, kind of. Um, so anyways, calories, there's 640 calories in there, but we shouldn't count calories when we eat ice cream, I don't think, like, come on. Uh, we're not thinking about calories when we're eating ice cream or milkshakes or any of that. Uh, I don't think we need to worry about that, so. Oh. 